Well, I joined Ford in 1997. And at that time, we were still in the office, was still a temporary office here in Alabang. Well, it was very exciting when you're putting up a new company, you're hiring a new team, you're building a plan, you're preparing for the launch of new products, you're building relationships. Those were very exciting and, of course, challenging at the same time. So we had our dream team, and I really believe it was a dream team. Incredible performance, I would say. And as a result of that, Ford Motor Company loved the Philippines. Gary Emmerich was the, the president and Dave Goodman was marketing sales. So there were, there were very few of us. And it was like a startup company, um, thinking about the products that would be brought in, uh, appointment of dealers. Um, it was a small family uh, with a big future. Ford was, uh, I would say, groping around for a direction in the beginning. And so when they came back, Ford had to come up with a very strong statement. And they did that through their products. That was the biggest hurdle point when we were talking to customers. They go, you know, if you buy a Ford now, you guys might leave again. And so on and so forth. So the nice thing about it, or the good thing about it, was that Ford actually invested quite a bit in Santa Rosa. They put in a whole manufacturing facility and so that became part of the story. I had a, a very difficult role in closing our manufacturing plant in the Philippines. I, I think it really tested my emotional um, resilience uh, because, of course, seeing what, what you have built from the ground up and then closing it, it's, it's really... Ford is a very popular brand worldwide. You know, it's a welcoming entry in, in the Philippine automotive market then. I first opened Ford Edsa in 1996. We opened our first showroom and uh, bring in the iconic expedition then. So that's what the start of Ford here. Since Ford had a fantastic strategy of putting a great image and prestige to the brand, that was what happened in the first decade of the business. The brand gained so much popularity and we as dealers promoted it with a lot of premium, a lot of prestige. And people became so interested with Ford because when they own a Ford, it means they have something to say in life. Actually, Ford is a very known brand here in the Philippines, and it's actually an aspirational brand. A lot of people who really know Ford really wanted to get a vehicle and own one. It's, it's quite a challenge and at the same time exciting to expand in different areas because, uh, you know, I, we wanted people to really try the Ford brand. And by expanding, we are able to service a lot of those customers who wish to own one. Part of the growing of the network is, uh, is the trust and confidence we have in the Ford brand. In fact, uh, we're still expanding. We're opening a new dealership, hopefully by next year. We opened our first dealership in 2019 towards the latter end. And uh, six months later, we actually had to close down because of the pandemic. Our greatest challenge was having to deal with birth pains of having a new company while struggling with figuring out how to operate in the pandemic, uh, plus dealing with reduced manpower and you know, from like a uh, resignation and, and government regulations. Uh, but thankfully, the people that remained stepped up to the challenge and found ways to adjust and work with what we had. Because we saw value to our, to our employees by ensuring that we sustained their livelihood. We saw in return their loyalty to us. What sets for uh, Philippines apart is the kind of culture that we have, the kind of people uh, that we have. So they will always cherish Ford as, a, as their second home. It's also a place where uh, everyone is treated equal. It's very important for us not just to think about business, but make sure that we also take care of our people. And that's still 
true up to, to this day. When I started, I, I really don't have any idea of the automotive industry. So I think the key learning is that when you're empowered, you will be determined to deliver and um, gain the trust of, your, uh, of other people. Ford is very good in conveying that um, I need to find ways. There is always a way. We just have to figure out. So I think for me that's really the positive impact of it. The output will not be there if it's just one person doing the job. We always believe in teamwork and that's why we, well it's team members for us. It's always a team here. That's how we get to the results work that we want. Ford is a caring company not just to employees but also to the community around because we always make sure that even how small help or support we extend to the community especially during disaster and calamities. Uh, you know, I'm very proud of what Ford stands for and uh, what they do for the community, their give back programs. Uh, the Vice President for Ford, Josie uh, Gonzalez, has been uh, on our board of our foundation now for as long as I can remember. It's great. Uh, she puts in so much work to that. And of course, Ford has their own foundation to do other things as well. So they give back so much to this country and so much to the community. So I'm so proud of them for that. I'm so proud to have an American company like Ford that does so much for the country. For many years, GK has been known for building houses, but we know that um, Poverty has many other faces. That's why uh, when we started to engage 10,000 barangays across the country, we look for partners who would like to innovate and would like to, to break boundaries with us. That's why uh, when, when Ford Philippines came in, uh, we were so glad to have a partner that is willing to go beyond the boundaries and explore um, more unserved communities. The most important thing there was uh, not the excitement or the adventure, but more on the hope that we bring to these communities na kahit may parating na bagyo, nandun yung Gawad Kalinga, nandun yung Ford, na kasama nila. Through the years, San Bosco is supported by Ford, especially in the skills training of the underprivileged youth. So through the support of Ford, which is scholarship, there are many young people who are beneficiaries of this training program as provided by Ford. I am most grateful for the commitment of Ford through the years in supporting so many student trainees in our institution. And because of this, more than 100 students have really been transformed, not only economically, but I believe for their future. And that is something that uh, we are grateful for. Yung pagtatapos ng pag-aaral, ito po yung susi para makakawa ka ng magandang trabaho. Yung pangarap ko po na unti-unti nang natutupad eh, makatulong po sa pamilya at saka sa nag-aaral ko po ng kapatid at saka sa PWD ko po na kapatid. My whole family uh, is made up of Ford fans. The more that we used Ford cars, uh, the more we realized how durable and reliable uh, the cars were. All the features are really, really good and really convenient for us users. I was a member of the Southeast Asian Games uh, skateboarding team and this is the, actually the vehicle that went with me to that journey. It's been with me on family trips, uh, right now a lot of football games, skate trips, surf trips, um, random uh, excursions and it, it's never failed me. What I love most about being a Ford customer is their, the way they treat their clients. Parang personalized yung dating nila. Siya yung first car ko pala na 50 years old ako nung natuto ako mag-drive. Dahil nakita ko siya, so talagang nag-ano ako na kailangan makakuha ko, nag-aral ako mag-drive. Well, I think the best thing that when you're wa walking into Ford, it makes you feel accomplished. When I walked into the showroom for the very first time, it felt very inspiring because it was like this prerequisite to your dream and your goal. Walking out of there, I knew that it was definitely going to get me to where I wanted to be. Ford in the future is going to be really exciting. I think Ford is in a really good place. With the world moving so fast to electrification, I believe that Ford is right there. They're ready for it. They have products for it already. 
the way business is going to be done with Ford will be different, which we are looking forward to also. Sometimes it's going to be scary, but you know, sometimes change is scary, but we look forward to um, being there with them. I see a lot of uh, young uh, people in the company at the moment at Ford Philippines, and there's a bright future ahead of them uh, in terms of development. Uh, the, the partnership so strong between Ancham uh, and Ford Motor Company, I don't see it ever, uh, ever diminishing. Home. Potential. Empowerment. Mga puso. Partnership. Innovation. Family. Reliable. Excellence. Everything. Congratulations Ford Philippines from one happy Ford customer for many years. I look forward to many, many more years that I get to drive your amazing vehicle, have it serviced by your amazing team. And hopefully when my kids are old enough to drive, they will experience the next 25 or so years uh, even better. I wish to congratulate the men and women of Ford Group Philippines on your 25th anniversary. So we as your dealer partners will be always here for you to help you serve our customers and make our customer experience the best way we can. So we hope that in the next 25 years, we will be together uh, to, have, to build a stronger partnership, but more importantly, to build more resilient and more empowered communities. Maraming salamat po sa Ford Scholarship Program. Salamat po sa opportunity na mabigyan ng gantong pagkakataon. Uh, sana mas marami po kayong matulungan sa mga taong nangangarap. Congratulations, Ford Group Philippines. I couldn't be more proud to be part of this team in our 25th year. Thrilled to be here and so happy to look forward to everything we have to look forward to. Congratulations, Ford team, for this uh, milestone. I always said this, that if Ford cannot make it in the Philippines, it cannot probably make it in any other market in the region. So, great job. Being number three in the market is quite an accomplishment. So, very special congratulations for that. It doesn't happen many places in the Ford world. I'm proud to be a Ford dealer and part of the Ford family. This is our company. We are in the people business. We are the greatest team. Ito ang iyong kompanya.